his 60 Minutes interview tonight, Donald Trump also talks about his use of Twitter. Here's Tony Docopo. It's a modern form of communication. There should be nothing you should be ashamed of. Donald Trump was talking about Twitter, of course, one of his most powerful and problematic tools on the campaign trail. Will he continue to tweet as president? Oh, yes. I'm not saying I love it, but it does get the word out. I have a method of fighting back that's very tough. Donald Trump's Twitter power is also relatively new. When President Obama first ran in 2008, Twitter had an estimated 5 million users total. Compare that to Trump's 15 million followers today. I think it helped me win all of these races where they're spending much more money than I spent. As president, Trump can hope to catch some of Twitter's most followed users, including Katy Perry, the world number one, and President Obama. I pick up, I'm picking up now, I think I picked up yesterday 100,000 people. Trump's tweets are popular because, for better or worse, they're raw. He's feuded with a beauty queen, retweeted praise from apparent white supremacists, and forwarded false data about African-American violence. Trump tells Leslie Stahl he'll tone it down as president. I'm going to do very restrained if I use it at all. But just today, at real Donald Trump feuded with the bad, dishonest, and very poor New York Times. It's impossible to know what the founders would have made of such 140 character comments or what they would think of the nation's new tweeter in chief. Tony DeCopel, CBS News, New York. You can see Leslie Stahl's full hour with President elect Trump and his family tonight on 60 Minutes.